A father buried his son before realizing he was alive. 82-year-old Frank Kerrigan received a phone call that his son was found dead behind a Verizon store in Fountain Valley. His son had been mentally ill and living on the street, so when the coroner's office said they verified the fingerprints matched his son's, he was heartbroken. Frank spent $20,000 on his son's funeral and mourned the tragic loss with his family. Then, a few weeks later, he received a call that changed everything. It was Frank's son. He was alive! Immediately, Frank called officials to find out that the coroner's office weren't able to match the fingerprints of the victim, and instead identified his son through an old driver's license photo. The mistaken identification resulted in the family suing the authorities for not properly examining Frank's son's body because he was homeless. The whole situation was terrifying, but in the end, they were just relieved that the man they buried wasn't their son.